Lollies, it's Lex, and I have another soupy build for you here today. So this is one of those rooms that you have an idea for, and you think you know what you're going to do, and then you go in to make it, and you have no idea what to do, <laughs> is basically what ended up happening. So I started off strong, and I was like, well, I definitely know that I want to do like a vintage, like old Hollywood styled kind of outdoor patio area. So that was like the general idea, because I'm trying to I'm trying to get as much out of this Vinter Glamour Glamour pack as as I can. That's until we get something else. I'm gonna keep trying to use this thing in as many ways as I can. So I knew that I wanted to do like a corner couch and a little ottoman, and I wanted to do the like you know the new light strings from the city living pack and blah blah blah. I was very ambitious, <laughs> so I really like how I actually ended up doing the string lights here. I'm using these like pom-pom lights as just like a reference point uh, for where I want to put the uh, poles here. Uh, because of the size of my room, the lights don't actually like meet up the way that they should. So I thought adding in those extra poles would kind of hide the fact of that. And I think it ended up looking really nice actually. That It just looks like they're like kind of double strung up here and I'm really pleased with that. The general layout of the patio though, I'm not very happy with and I had a really hard time choosing a floor color for this room. It was just like, I wanted to do tile, but then I didn't like how any of the tiles looked and then I wanted to do stone, but I didn't like how any of the stones looked and I'm pretty sure that that's just wood that I ended up going with. I wanted to stick with golds, blacks, and blues is what I was trying to do here because I feel like gold and blue um, look really nice together. That, that blue complements the gold and the black really well. Uh, but I don't know, it was just so hard to figure out what I wanted to do with this room. And I don't want to say I'm unhappy with it, but it's not my best. <laughs> I'll, I'll say that. It's not my best. I was going to put in one of my like custom ponds over here, but then it was in the way of the rug and I didn't want to remove the rug because I thought the rug was kind of really tying everything together and it just ended up kind of a mess for a little while. But I ended up getting rid of the pond, I just leave the fountain, and then I actually take one of the new big orchid plants um, that I love because I grow orchids in, in real life. So I was like, oh, an orchid, oh it's perfect. So I used that, I made it a little bit bigger and kind of put it on top of the fountain. So it ended up looking really nice. That's that's something that I will take from this room and use in something else. Those chairs go away and I replace them with a couch and I just kind of move those chairs over to where the fire pit is because then I thought it needed a fire pit. There's too much going on. <laughs> There's too much going on in this in this space, but I'm not unhappy with it. But again, it's not the best. <laughs> I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Build. Have a fantastic rest of your day. Thanks so much for watching. Leave a like. Let me know how your day's going down in the comments. I love to read them. Happy first build of the new year. Hope everybody had a fantastic New Year's Eve, wonderful New Year's Day, and I'll see everybody next time.